Hi, I'm Natalie and I would like to share my story of how I followed my voice. In 2016, when I was 37, I decided that I would go back to college to study an HND in graphic design and illustration. And what this meant for me was making the decision to leave my uh, very successful and very well paid uh, job in advertising. Uh, so I could go and study for two years graphic design. Now, uh, a lot of people, when I told them, said, oh, you're very brave for doing this. Um, I had some very different comments, uh, some supportive, some not so supportive. Um, but I was really determined to do this for me. It was something that I'd wanted to do for years. I'd kept putting off. Um, I'd worked and, and managed creative teams, but... Um, I'd never, you know, kind of had the technical design skills. So going back to college was a it was a, a really unique experience for me because I'd not been in the education uh, or, or, or studying for some time. So uh, kind of learning to challenge yourself, learn new skills, technical skills, being back at college with uh, people a lot younger than myself and juggling kind of three part-time jobs as well. So it was... Um, it was a hard decision to make, but one that I really kind of wanted to do. And I'd been kind of pushing down my voice inside for a long time not to do it. Um, and so what this has meant for me, because I wanted to um, create a way of working that really works for me, is that I freelance now. Um, I gained my qualification in design uh, in 2018. And how I work now is I have um, part-time jobs or contracts and I freelance and do design work. Um, so I do design work for other clients or I do design projects for myself as well. And what this means is that it allows me to tap into all areas of my interests, which I enjoy doing. So um, it's really kind of uh, provide a different level of fulfilment. So it was a really, a really hard decision and it was really hard work, uh, but it was really worth it. And the feeling of getting my qualification at the end of it, but not just about the qualification, about all of the experience, different ways of thinking, different ways of looking at things and actually carving out a future that worked for me. Um, so if anyone's watching this, I would just say, uh, yeah, it can be really hard to um, make those changes, uh, but even, you know, it, it's maybe not as big a change as, as, as what I did, but even kind of little changes that you can make to move your kind of life in the direction that you want it to go into and uh, not always listening to what everyone else says, but listening to what you want to do and working out or how you do that, finding out a way, and that might not be massive change, it might just be small steps over a period of time to, to get to a place that you want to be. So I hope my story maybe inspires someone else, and I would really love to um, hear more stories. Thank you.